the benefits here, and, and I'm comparing benefits um, on somebody clicking on an ad and going to a website, a mobile website, versus a call. So if I go to a mobile website, I'm going to see a large form there that I'm going to need to fill out. That's going to be like, you know, what's your household income, where do you live, right, all this kind of stuff so that you can figure out if you qualify for insurance. And that, that's sort of a long path to purchase. Whereas a call, if I make a call, I'm doing all that over the phone. And what an advertiser would typically see is um, higher conversion rates because you have people talking to people and you're you're you know you're selling them and you're able to to sort of you know do a better job versus just a static web page and then you're seeing order values higher not in an insurance product but let's say telecom if i was telecom i would see higher order values because i'm able to upsell on the phone whereas upsell on a on a small screen is not as easy to do prioritization and making sure that you're doing the make you making the right experience for the customer those are the challenges, but it's, it's very important to have your entire experience in a mobile-friendly manner, um, whether it be an app or a mobile website, probably both, right? And there's a lot of different priorities that are going on there. It takes some time, right? You have to put some development work into that. You have to make sure that you're thinking about the customer. You have to make sure that you're looking at the end goal and, and building the products that make the most sense for them. You also just can't go out and just throw an app out in the world, right? You can't just throw an app out on the, on the store and then be done. Right, that's not it. You, know, you have to make sure that that app works properly. You have to make sure that it works integrated with web. Because apps are, apps are very interesting too, because people think that you know, going mobile is just an app, but it's not the case. Um, most of the time people install an app and then they, they only do it once, right? And so if you're looking for customers, they're not gonna have your app. So you have to make sure you have a good mobile experience that either gets them through to the mobile web page, gets them through the phone, or gets them to install your app because you're buying products. So you have to think about that entire customer journey.